Okay, in this video we're going to show you how to designate a bridge restoration in the administration screen of the 4.0 in-lab software. Uh, we're going to do a CAD-on bridge, a multi-layer bridge from tooth number 18 to 20. So the very first thing we're going to do, we always work right to left, we're going to designate bridge restoration, crown, biogeneric individual. Since we're doing CAD-on, we must hit the multi-layer prior to hitting the teeth. We'll click multi-layer, tooth number 18, tooth number 20 are our abutments. And we'll go ahead and next hit Pontic, biogeneric individual, verify that multi-layer is still checked, and we'll go ahead and hit the Pontic on tooth number 19. Okay, so you see that define restoration just turned from red to green. Uh, before we can move on to the next step, we need to go ahead and select the veneering material, which if we're doing CAD on, is obviously going to be Ivoclar Emacs. Select the framework material, which is going to be Zirconia. If I'm doing the CAD on system, I'm going to stick with their Zirconia, which is going to be Ivoclar Zircad. And hit OK. And you are ready to go ahead and move forward uh, with uh, your scanning. Now conversely, you know, you also have the opportunity to do a Vita rapid layer bridge in this scenario. So if you wanted to switch this material from a, a CAD on to a Vita rapid layer, all you'd have to do is go ahead and hit edit restoration, go to veneering structure, we'll choose Vita, Trilux Forte as a veneering structure, and for the framework, we'll go ahead and choose Vita, Instagram YZ, and hit OK. And there we just switch the material uh, to do this in the Vita rapid layer technique. In further videos, we'll go ahead and show you how to designate different uh, types of bridges and connectors. Uh, but the key is for multilayer is to make sure you have multilayer checked prior to choosing your teeth, and you'll be okay.